Hi everyone, it's Karen here. Um, I wanted to share with you this book that I've altered. It was ori my original, The Little Old Woman and Her Pig book, uh, back from like, I don't know, 1960 or something. And I have, um, I cut the front and back cover, which are really thick cardstock. Um, and separated the pictures. I've used some of the pages to decorate. I just think it's the cutest thing ever. And I did finish all the ends of the, um, every page and the book with some washi tape. And it just has so much in it that I thought I would um, tape it for you so you could see for yourself. Um, the inside cover, I've used like, I don't even, maybe four different stamp sets. To stamp little images and things. Um, here's a tag, just a plain, and then I tried to distress it up because I want this to be vintage and old timey, you know. And um, so this is a pocket here on the inside cover, and then these are file folders. Um, it's this is still attached, and I love this binding, this way of binding because you can put different size pages right in the book. I love that. Here's another one of the little pictures. Um, and this is just a journaling card. Um, this right here is an envelope. And I've added um, the little corner. This is from the paper line. And the tag that goes down in. Um, I mainly do that because if I give it to somebody, I want them to know they can put pictures there. And then here's a tag. Um, that stamp is from uh, Unity, and this is a little uh, crafty companion stamp. Little girl holding her bear. Um, it has tons of room. You'd be able to fit lots more pictures in the envelope, of course. Um, here's another little stamp from that same stamp set. It's a wonderful world. It's so cute. That that's a cute stamp set. Did a lot of die cuts. Uh, got a lot of my. Um, scraps out that I had uh, die cuts and stuff scraps from. Here's another little pocket. I finished both sides again with the washi tape. Here's a little tag. Stamped it. Um, that's a unity stamp right there, the memories. Um, it's right down. And most of these, the uh, pictures can be pretty good size. Here's a leftover die cut and I cut it up and here's the other side to it. I put this there so they'd know they could put stuff behind that. And then here's a tag. Life is beautiful. Um, and this is like a huge tag and pocket. Um, this whole thing measures about um, eight, eight by five and a half or six, about six. So here I cut a doily in half and got half here, half here. And my friend Retta, she sells these cutter files. Um, I'll put a link to her shop below. Here is a cutter file I purchased. Um, this little owl. I think it's so cute. And he kind of fits in with the theme. Here's another tag out of this paper line. Um, this is a large tag too. But this thing is going to hold a lot of pictures. Here's another page from the book. Um, uh, here's a little thing where they can tuck pictures behind. This is another one of the file folders, so it's two pages. This one, this is attached. This is all one piece. And here's some stamping that I did on this mat. Here's a, a leftover die cut that says love. Another mat. Huge. This, this is going to hold some really good sized pictures when it's full. And then here's another one, and I have a little stamp that says photo, place photo here. So they'll be able to just stick that right in here behind this. Um, and the last page, of course, is from the book. And the back cover is all original. Um, the original book. So let me know how you like it. I just think it's the coolest thing ever. And I love it. And um, I may even find my old pictures and put them in here. Um, I may not can stand to give it away. But um, give me a thumbs up. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye.